Hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Having a bad day at the office? Work is dried up around here, and I have bills to pay. Time is money for a guy like me. That sucks. Wish I could drive right out of Arcadia Bay. Whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse, and a slut trying to commit suicide. Really? Maybe you should leave then. What if I could? And even that shifty Rachel what's her face asked me once if I drive her to Los Angeles. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you tell me about her? Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? I'd love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18 wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. Oh. Hey, how's it going? Peachy. How the hell did you know that? My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town because I love taking pictures of truckers. You knew Rachel. She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers or real work. Oh, so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those you know who know what. Good riddance. But you can take pictures of my truck anytime. Take care. Oh, I can do that now. Boom. Oh, you happy. Jackass. It was up to me. I would have took the picture of the I would have took the picture of the damn truck. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Oh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. Right. Okay, good. There's a nice, lovely uh, cop over here. First, let me talk. I can't talk to him. Such a shame. Talk to this jackass. Plate. Spill it. Beer can. Spill. Hmm. You eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans. <laughs> to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. <clears throat> you show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them, and you look like ass. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. There she is, Super Maxine. That's your new nickname, Ronald Bay. Oh, that was a different Sorry, time this time. But you did earn it. was the same one. We're all real proud of you for helping Kate down. Thanks, Officer Barry. I was just lucky. 
and right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Black Bull Academy. Thanks. Wait. Okay. I'm going to assume that he's also know about uh, Dave. I feel like David Madsen represents Blackwell. Not for long. He's a loose cannon. We all respect him for his service, but he's too eager. He's eager to be a dick to me and Chloe. That's true. He was ranting about a stolen gun, and then I tuned out. Somebody's always out to get him. Amber. Is that your punk rock girl outfit now that you've been suspended? Thanks for trying to get me in trouble, you tweet bitch. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. What can I do for you, Max? Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell. With Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. That boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. And to his credit, he had a revelation. He saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? There she is, Super Mac. Hello, Please. officer. Okay. I'm glad you. Sorry, I was just so fucking focusing. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, you don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent? Taking over Arcadia Bay. You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago. So I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. You should have jumped, asswipe. Shit. What are the other signs then? Oh, oh, oh. Appa Apparently, the graffiti I was looking for was in there. Huh. You 
You act so scary, but you did save all those dogs. One, I'm not acting. Two, who told you about the dogs? It's actually a great story. You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Besides, you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. He brought. Now back to Chloe. And make sure that we haven't not spoken. Now this I can fix. Ow. Alyssa, watch out. Quick thinking, Max. Mm-hmm. Deja vu. There's dust on the dust now. There's dust on the dust! I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. If we'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set. Throw! It's a treat, treat, boy! I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace. But let's not waste time. Was there an option the to throw? busy now, but he might come back. Yeah, he might. And I'd rather not toss the bone at the road. I just heard a truck <laughs> drove by. Damn. I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can really? you see us heading no. down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Yes, you'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Just daydreaming. How are you? You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. Ken Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place is nasty. Frank must have a reason to keep a police raider nearby. Good to know Frank has a knife lying around. I also got an extra one. That's a pretty extreme lighter. Yeah, sure it is. Are these for Frank, or is he selling them? Or, or both. both. Hold up, what? Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Is Frank going to deal online now? I don't know. Don't. Hey, 
I could pry this vent open with the right tool. Crappy wife out here. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. Wait, what? I didn't catch that clue, what'd you say? Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. <laughs> Recycle, dude. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. Ooh, Frank's stash. No more secrets. Hey. That's a pretty extreme lighter. This is almost as good as a set of keys. I broke the knife for nothing. Stop it. My blade will open any portal. Rachel and Frank's dog. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. But why? I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Hmm. Trouble in paradise. Two thousand thirteen. Oh, yeah, no, leave no evidence. Whoa, that makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on the stepfucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit! Who hasn't? Fuck everybody! Chloe! You realize your dog is outside the RV, do you? 